right, and that's where we're going right now, where Brett Ship is inside Reunion Arena, where this party is about to begin in about a few minutes, I guess. Brett? Hi, guys. Everybody saw the group Pantera on the float on their way to Reunion Arena. You wonder how that allegiance got started in that alliance. Here's the story behind the story. Vinny Paul of Arlington is not your typical Dallas Stars fan. Stars, baby. Yeah, all the way. He goes to most of the home games. He'll even travel to some of the away games. Plus, he's written a little ditty for the stars that goes something like this. Dallas, stars, Dallas, stars, Dallas, stars, Dallas, stars. Actually, Paul had some help from the members of his popular heavy metal band, Pantera. And in between sold-out stadiums and recording studios, Paul makes time for his new passion, Dallas Stars hockey. Then a few weeks ago, his close friend, Stars defenseman Craig Ludwig, approached him with a smashing idea. Come up with a new fight song to motivate the team in the playoffs. And he's like, dude, we're really sick of skating around to that same song. We've been skating to it for two or three years. You think you guys could do something? Dallas Stars! So Pantera got busy and crafted the tune that is played not only during the skate around between periods, but in the locker room for motivation during the playoffs. Game six, Colorado, they needed it, broke it out again. Four to one, they win. Come back home, four to one to win. That song's eight and two. Only lost two to that song. We've got Pantera on our side, so that's got to be a positive for us. But there it is. Are, uh, Even center Joe Newendike says the song the is a hit. And, uh, now the question you know, is, uh, can Vinny Paul prognosticate, too? What's your prediction? Stars and six. Don't take them lightly. That's the way I feel about it. Did he say stars and six? He was wrong. It was six and a half, almost seven, but he was right. The stars win. Back to you guys. All right, thanks a lot, Brett. Uh, one more thing. If you got any chance to get in, it, it's only two ways. you got to have a star season ticket, or if you got a ticket to Game 7, which, of course, didn't happen. Game 7 of the Stanley Cup playoff, then you can possibly, possibly get in. That's right. We'll be back after a short break, live from downtown Dallas. Gloria Campos and John McKay. See you later.